Baez, Baez with some space, he shoots, saved by Foreman, rebound in front, Baez scores! Joey Baez, 29th goal of the year! The best team in the NHL in the regular season was the Lone Star Brahmas, as they went 42-9-2 through 53 games, giving them a league-leading 86 points. They were in first place in the South Division, and were looking forward at a chance to win the Robertson Cup for the first time since 2017. Yeah, we we were as a staff and as an organization, we were really disappointed. We it's a lot of work that goes into building teams, and when you're starting to find success and you're having a good year, you really want to see how it pans out, and plays out. The Brahmas have always been known for their defensive style, but last year may have been their best effort as they allowed just 81 goals. They were also a top five team offensively, led by Robert Morris University commit Matt Guerra. He had 63 points on the year, good for third in the North American Hockey League. Joey Baez led the league with 32 goals, and he committed to Army. The Brahmas will also have to replace two really good netminders. Caden Bailey was named the goaltender of the year after he went 25-2 with a 1.32 goals against average and a 940 save percentage. He also tied an NHL record with 11 shutouts. Ludwig Person was 22-4 with a 156 goals against, a 932 save percentage, and 7 shutouts of his own. In total, the Brahmas had 16 players earn NCAA commitments. It really shows the validation of how hard it takes to get those D1 commits. It's not easy, and everyone wants them, but are you willing to put in the work? You're willing to do the extra stuff. And I think our team, um, you know, we, we had a lot of commitments last year, and we were excited about every guy that got committed, and we're, we're excited about the new class to come in and get their opportunity to try and get committed too, because it is put the work in first. You just don't come here and get committed. You still have to put in the work. Lone Star will be looking to reload and be on top of the South Division again in 2020-2021.